Hey everybody, this is Christine and welcome to my shopping therapy couch. Usually I do my hauls with my cat Montague, but he's outside right now. So anyway, um, if you're interested, this is a Dollar Tree haul. So sit back, relax, take your troubles to the door and do some shopping therapy with me. Okay, so I thought all this was not going to do if I uh, did it one at a time. So anyway, I ended up getting going to three Dollar Trees um, this week and actually one with my sister and uh, one with my husband and one with just my uh, daughter and myself. So anyway, um, my sister went nuts. She literally with the nuts. Um, we did take a little bit of a road trip and her son is allergic to peanuts. So this was her opportunity to have nut products. Um, but unfortunately, uh, the trip lasted for a little bit too long and uh, she couldn't bring all this stuff back home So she just gave it to me. So anyway, so I will start with that. So uh, There is some pretzel nuggets here. You can notice like one of the bags is gone. They're okay um, Because the way that they cooked it the peanut butter kind of gets hard and shriveled up and on the inside But I still think it's good for lunches and snacks and as you can see here, we got some sweet and spicy mix. And of course, I have broken into this. These are yummy. It's kind of like a little bit of spice on like these little string parts. And then it's like almost like a honey roasted uh, peanut. And uh, I don't think you have you are supposed to be on a diet of any kind when you're uh, eating this stuff because this stuff is just so I don't know it's kind of it's kind of bad so anyway I think there is like three or four oh there's five servings in that and so each serving is like 130 calories yeah and then there's a pretty high fat content so yes so if you're going to enjoy these make sure that you are not on a diet because <laughs> diets are not going to work with these so anyway we got two of these delicious things I uh, can't wait to try this chili lemon uh, peanuts and then we got this hot and spicy peanuts and then we have the regular beer nuts and like I said not for dieters at all so anyway those are the yummy treats that my sister left for me so I will be enjoying it and my hubby uh, will be taking that to work and the little one will enjoy it too like every now and then for snacks so okay so anyway, and then the bath bombs at one particular store was on clearance. Before it was 25 cents per piece and it wasn't up until the register, um, they ended up being one cent. So if I would have known that, I would have grabbed the whole bin. But anyway, <laughs> this is what I got this time. So um, there is some round ones. So I ended up getting three of the round ones you can see here two of the cacti and of course I had to do this at the very back so there you go there's that we got a unicorn a cat face a pineapple we got a heart shape there is a diamond and the last but not least a flamingo and if they still have them when I go back to that store I will be grabbing a ton because my daughter uses them and I'm sure somebody would appreciate that in a gift basket so it's, um, it won't hurt to stock up so anyway that's that um, Usually I'll do some repurchases and uh, reviews, no reviews today, but I will start on the repurchases. So like I said, my hubby went to one of them with me and he actually picked out his own treats. So one of his favorites is um, cotton candy. We didn't get any gummy bears this week, so he picked this out and he picked this one out because he likes Skittles, but uh, he ended up picking out the freezer pop so we did get that 
for him. I can't wait to try these too because it's still you know summertime and it's still hot. So I thought that was a good uh, purchase there. Um, got our standard freezer and the gallon and the quart bags there. So you can see all that. And if you're interested, there are the stats on that. I wasn't sure if I had already purchased this one, but I got it anyway. There was one that was kind of cracked open. You know, it has like the little seal on it. So I was able to smell it and it smelled really good. Uh, I like to stock up on things, but anyway, this one is the pink cactus and aloe. So we will be putting this in the storage and maybe I'll even... Um, change the container because I really don't like it. Um, I usually can't control the flow of it very good so that's why I change the containers out of these things. So and then uh, the our cats have had some fleas even with the flea, flea medication so I do treat the carpets and these things make the carpet smell good anyway. So got some of the Arm & Hammer um, carpet uh, deodorizer eliminator and of course it like when I when I use this in the hope that it'll dry out the fleas and hopefully you can vacuum vacuum it up but anyway so got more of that and there was something new in the laundry section and these were these are the honey suckle dryer sheets and I just thought that was good and I wish you guys could smell it because they smell pretty darn good. So I'll put that in the collection and up in the storage. So, okay. So let's get into some of the school uh, activities. Uh, so I have a little one and uh, so we do little projects and things like that. And also I do try to give her a boost before she goes to school. So anyway, we're looking into daycares, but uh, for right now, I'm just doing a little bit of the homeschool with her. So I got her two workbooks this week. So one is um, like first words, basically, and I really like these because they're really interactive and she can either pull off the stickers or, um, you know, just uh, try to like, we'll try to do like or like t -t like tractor you know that kind of stuff but anyway um, here's some of the pictures and the stickers so these are basically um, school assignments that I work into some lesson plans so like I said here's some words here's one with animals and we did do some sea life so we can do that um, so um, habitats and of course it has the same deal with the stickers uh, I'll be doing a lesson plan not anytime in the future but I do have a folder ready for it um, so this is uh, part of a series like they had them before but this one is my dress-up buddy and so basically it's cool I mean they have stickers and then you put it on the body forms and so this is more of like the professions so um, so we'll be doing a uh, week's worth of uh, you know what do I want to do when I grow up that kind of thing so I thought that was good uh, as an addition to uh, lessons and so what my plan is is here's another one in the series that I already did and so there's say there's like the body form and instead of like a two minute activity I actually put like the little sticky tabs that's just a I don't I never use a uh, formal like cardstock I just have whatever I got on hand so anyway she can use that over and over and over and over again so that's my plan with this guy as well Uh, we do do quite a bit of arts and crafts too. So um, a couple weeks ago we got a sun catcher and so I got another one. So this one is a dinosaur. It comes with all this. The brushes aren't too great but you know what? If somebody 
you know, like she just kind of like jams the, all the colors in there but anyway i got that and i didn't realize that they didn't come with like hooks or suction cups so i, I ended up just getting a pack of that because uh now that she'll have two sun catchers and they're just plastic so i haven't even tried to see if the paint will wash off and that she could use it over again i don't know uh, i'll see but if that's the case, then I'll get some new paints and stuff and she can use that over and over again. All right, now the favorite part of the haul and it's gonna take the rest of the haul is the fall stuff. So um, ran into this sign at one of the stores. I just thought it was so beautiful and actually um, there's less glare from the um, uh, from the uh, from the glitter so but you know that was my thing like in the store I was like does the letters do they stand up um, you know well enough against the background so you can actually see the letters but I, but I hadn't seen the sign before so I went ahead and got it so I thought that was beautiful and it has like all like kind of pastel -y pumpkins which I really enjoy that brings me to all the pumpkins that I got. So let's put this one aside. So they kind of have these uh, star patterns here. So I got two of these little green ones. And this is like a light orange. I got two of these really beautiful blue. They almost look black on the camera, but they're actually blue. Hey, you can see me in the <laughs> in the reflection. And then I got the little jewelry box. I thought that was really nice. So got that. So I guess I can actually put that with all the pumpkins, but I'll probably uh, use that for something else but I thought that was pretty and I wanted it okay like I was saying that we do a lot of crafts so she likes um, the painted things so I got her this owl and I thought that was really cute and she can paint that however she likes and there's the back and it just has an opening there so we got that one oops and I think I'm going to save this one for me. And so here is a pumpkin. And I think I'm just going to keep it white. And maybe just paint all the leaves and the stalk. Alright. So. Usually they sell these things like individually. But I think they're a little bit larger. But anyway there was these two packs of corn. So as you can see here, I thought they were so sparkly and cool. So they have like kind of the, um, the toppers on there. So they had one in uh, this dark orange and then they had this in the yellow. So I'm not sure if you can see that, but I thought that would be cool for like a centerpiece or a wreath. So I got those guys and then they had these really nice bottle brush trees I know that they had um, different colors but the only ones I could see was these green ones and I thought that was cool I thought that would be good for fall and if you do winter scenes so I thought that wasn't really neat so I did pick up two of those maybe if I see other ones like I think at one store I saw them in orange and purple but I don't know why I didn't pick those up, but uh, I didn't. And then I got some really nice fall stickers. So this one's been hauled quite a few times. And so they're almost like a stained glass. So I thought that was nice. And then here's like another fall theme with the pie and candles and more pumpkins and I just, I really was into those, so I did get that. And then, 
Well, the last but not least, I got some florals. So you can't really see these very well, but the leaves are like a bluish green and I just thought they were so gorgeous. So you got the little creamy pumpkin there, that acorn and some of the berries. So I did end up getting three of those. And that'll be with um, a different arrangements that I'll be making. And then they had these unusual, it says blocking ball. So <laughs> I just thought those were cool and unusual. So, and I ended up getting one in the cream and then there was some in the blue. But anyway, that is it for my haul. I hope you guys all enjoyed it and I hope you guys have a fantastic weekend. All right. See you next week, everyone. Bye-bye.